Okay, so there are two ways of creating a screen capture on an iPad. The first one, and my preferred way, is if you've got an Apple Pencil, uh, you can just flick from the bottom left hand corner upwards, and as simple as that, it takes a photo of whatever's on screen at the time. You then get all the markup tools down the bottom here that you can choose from, and then you can annotate straight over the top of that image uh, and uh, use all the tools of the markup to annotate the picture. Uh, you then get your exporting options and so on, uh, or you can hit done. You can then save it to photos or the files app and away you go. So that's screen capture number one. Another way of doing that is uh, pressing the home button and the power button at the same time. So by clicking those two at the same time, you then get a photo that gets saved straight to the camera roll for you to then mark up or add to whatever work you're doing there. So the two methods of screen capture that I've mentioned apply to iPad 7th gen or below or some of the earlier iPad Pro models. You might be lucky enough to have a new iPhone uh, that doesn't have a home button or one of the new iPad Pros that also don't have a home button. You might be wondering, how do I do a screen capture with those devices? So what you need to do is just press the sleep wake button on the right hand side of the phone and the volume up button together and when you squeeze those two buttons together it will create a screen capture that you can then mark up or annotate or use for however you like after that. So same applies to iPad Pro that is. Okay so that was three ways to create a screen capture on an iPad or iPhone. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, head across to my YouTube channel and check out some of the other videos that are there as well.